and students of Bayero University, Kanu, have shown their displeasure at the federal government and ASU. And this was hours after the announcement of a one-month warning strike by the union. We now bring you their reactions in our street views. <laughs> We're not happy about this strike. We want the federal government to help us and sort everything out between them and us, because this is actually affecting us. It's not affecting the federal government and also it's not affecting the ASU government, because all of them have done yes. It's meaning us, and then we are the leaders of tomorrow, which is not fair to us. Most of them, their children are not schooling here. Most of them, are, their children are in private universities, outside countries. But we, we are here trying to even make it, but they are not trying to help us. So once, please, the federal government should take action about this. I'm calling on the Nigerian government that please they should resolve this issue with this ASU strike because if we are going back to, back to our societies now, I'm going back to our societies. We have nothing to do. So federal government should look into this and please resolve the issue so that we can, we won't go back to our society and form liability or something very bad to our society. Please, I'm calling on governments, on the federal government to resolve this issue with us. We are not feeling happy. We, are not, we, are, we feel very angry. But we don't. We know that we can't do anything. The only thing that we ask us to do is always to do better for students. Because our future is deteriorating. Our future is destroying. How do they expect us to move with life when all this is happening? At least I believe that governments have been hearing one or one or two things going on about this thing. And what I want them to do is that they should try and meet up to every demand that the ASU is doing because we are not getting younger, we are getting older, and we have life to work, live. Not that we spend all our years in school doing one or two things. Many of them, they have their children outside the country schooling. While we, we are trying to manage life in country Nigeria, thinking of a better place for Nigeria. But all this happening, and it will lead to many things like robbing youth outside the street and many things will be happening. We don't want what happened last time to happen because when youth are outside, many things will be happening. So they should try and listen to what they ask and make sure that everything is already fine on time.